The value we see from coming to an event like Future Offices is that we're talking directly to workplace experts that understand these issues and they're dealing with them on a daily basis. I'm excited to be here meeting so many people from the top brands in the world. There's an energy here, there's an excitement about workplace and about where we're going as an industry. It gives you the ability to talk closely to people for a given length of time so they can technically understand your products. The spaces that we create obviously impact the health and well-being of our occupants and equity or equitable design is an enormous part of that impact. The idea of going above and beyond code to try and design our spaces so that they're as accessible for as many people as possible. There's all sorts of different areas of the office that are just kind of done in the previous way and, and it is up to all of us to build new products and discover and test them and give feedback to these companies so they can build what is going to be efficient, what people are going to like find secure, where we're going to find all this compliance. We're now talking about activity-based workspaces and this in 1957 had that. Building was intentionally designed to have an open layout but with different breakout areas for people to do work in collaborative mode and also in a way to get privacy throughout their day. My favorite part of Future Offices Conference is the expo. Just learning about all the, the kind of new technologies that's out there, the stuff that I don't know about that I think like I have an issue in my office and wow that is the, the solution. I don't have to actually go search for it, it's right here. Now, looking to come 2020, um, expand this conference uh, overseas uh, and run a UK iteration.